finished taking out all the spark plugs. Turns out these two spark plugs on the passenger side, they had some oil on them. The rear was good, but these two, and actually this front one was the worst. Second one had a little oil, third one was perfect. So looks like we will be swapping out those valve covers eventually. Um, still pretty happy that it's not as much oil as I thought uh, would be on my spark plug. So that's a good sign at least, but there is oil. So we'll definitely replace those. Now we're gonna install the R35 injectors. So first you have these brackets, right side, meaning I'm guessing I go, you know, left, right. And both of them will be pointing the arrows right here. You want them pointing towards the front. So this one is gonna go in here like that. And I know you guys probably can't see, but I'll shine the light on it once I get this in here. It goes like this. Bolts to the stock coil pack location like so, like that. And then the coil packs will bolt to the other location. So those just go in like that. I'm probably gonna install these right now and then uh, put the new spark plugs in. So I'll be right back. All right, all the spark plugs are in. And I'll show you guys the brackets. Might show it better on the driver's side. So there it is right there. The CZB, CZP bracket. Goes in the stock coil pack location and then the new coil pack will bolt into right there. And yeah. Pretty easy install, so we're gonna get the GTR coil packs in, and then we'll be done. And there we go, guys. Coil packs are all back together. All clipped in really nicely. Same with over there. Uh, overall, this kit from Concept Z Performance, uh, everything bolted up great. Didn't have to do any special modifications, splicing, anything like that, so. Uh, tomorrow, I'm going to buy the new um, PVC delete filters. We'll reconnect the intake tube and we'll start her up and take her for a test drive. Uh, so in the meantime, I'm going to leave you guys with this. Stars.